Hello again everybody, Pierce Wise here with match number 46 in the loser's bracket of the Final Fantasy Tactics 1.3 AI Tournament Season 5. Uh, today's fighters are Pokétex and Yoizo. Pokétex is team in their third match of the loser's bracket, and they have a Cockatorus, a Sacred, a uh, Uribo, and uh, Clarence the Ninja, who has item secondary, also damage split, and equip armor. And on the other side, Yoizo, their team is in the first their first match in the loser's bracket, and they have uh, a Knight with item secondary, also speed save, move HP up, attack up. Uh, Bob is a ninja with punch art secondary and defense up, total of 6 move and uh, 11 speed. An oracle with yinging magic and time magic can has, uh, cast haste and stop, also paralyze, sleep, and uh, spell absorb. Also has a crystal shield. And then red mage, the wizard, who has uh, all the level 3 black magic, flare, also white magic, and abandon plus feather mental combo. Uh, should be noted that with her um, fire spells, she can heal the ninja and the knight, who both have uh, fire absorption. Um, compatibility wise, the uh, Uribo in this match has um, has worst or has bad compatibility with Yoizo's entire team, so that might make uh, some charms rather difficult. Other than that, everything is normal. Um, I still do like Pokétax's team; has the edge there. Um, we've seen him fight tooth and nail through three matches, through two matches so far in the losers bracket. So, uh, but we shall see. First map today is number ninety-seven. We're inside the Castle Gate in Lasalia, and off we go. So here's the map again. We have the monsters on the left, and then uh, Yoizo's team in the red on the right. Uh, monsters having the range and the speed edge in this. They're going to get the first turn. Thrown Pirate's Blade is going to miss the wizard. Um, Uribo's going to follow with a please eat, and that's going to hit. So positive statuses on the ninja. Yoizo's ninja going in for a throw. That's going to hit the Uribo for 117 damage. Uh, he's going to get hit in turn and uh, knocked to the side. Sacred's going to be out of range to do anything. Uh, Yoizo's team moving. Knight can't do anything, but the wizard charges a spell. Uh, Oracle is going to follow that with a stop spell of her own, but she could get caught mid-charge. Wizard is, is going to throw and hit the, um, or Ninja is going to throw and hit the Wizard, and then, did he double turn? Did he just take the Oracle down as well? I just saw two kills, just like that. Um, then Uribo misses, okay, both Ninjas getting double turns now, so Uribo's down, 14 and 11 speed for both of them. Um, Ninja gets hit, knocked into critical, counters, gets one hit off, then gets killed by the Taurus. Just like that, we have four bodies on the field. Um, Yoizo's knight bringing back the wizard. Um, Ninja's going to get a turn. He's going to go on the defensive, bring the Rebo back. Um, wizard going to charge up a, probably a Cure 3. Yep, Cure 3 is going to hit. Um, bring him back, or bring her back. Ninja, again, going to get a turn. These guys are fast. Throws up a Pyrus Blade. Wizard's in critical. Yoizo's going to retreat. Ninja for, um, Yoizo gets re-raised and shockers himself, but by shockering so soon, heals up two of Pogetax's, um, monsters. Then gonna, is going to get killed by the Kakatoris. The Sacred's going to get a Mimic Titan off, which is going to do a uh, good amount of damage to the Knight, 140, but he tanks it. He's going to, um, wow, he's going to attack the Kakatoris and get Hamedoed, which is actually going to miss, but he's pretty much, his entire turn has been negated. Um, Wizard, still in critical, going to heal herself yet again. Another Please Eat onto the Ninja, which is going to miss. Um, so we have Cure 3 going off, Wizard healing himself herself for 205 damage. Um, Beak is going to attack, and that's going to miss the Knight with the Evasion. Uh, Ninja, not in range to do anything. Protective status is wearing off. Phoenix down now. Yoizu's, um, Knight trying to keep order, trying to bring groups back. But a Mimic Titan's gonna go off. Um, so the, uh, Oracle's gonna eat it. Kakatoris and Knight both taking damage. Kakatoris now gonna get to please eat, though. But that's gonna miss. So that unit's still vulnerable. With a Wizard charging up a spell, but again, gonna, could get caught mid-charge. Yeah, thrown for Pyrus Plate, and she's down. It's all up to Yoizu's Knight now. Who's gonna catch a Wind Strike. He'll get hit for almost 200. Um, then he's going to attack and get Hamedoed again. So, um, dependence on physical attacks really coming to bite Yoizo in this beginning. Uh, this first round. We have positive status. We have another throw. That's going to get blocked with a shield, I believe. Um, shake off. That's going to hit, though. And Pokétex has won the first round. So, congratulations. We will move on to the large map and round two. Alright, it's time for round two of Pokétex versus Yoizo. We are in the, uh, Yardao, um, uh, weapon storage for our round two for the large map. Um, for all we've talked about Pogetax's monsters, it was uh, his ninja in round one that had a, a huge effect on things, getting a really early double turn, uh, so 14 speed plus haste, which actually is going to miss right there, the please it's going to miss, um, killing two magical units before Yoizo could even really do anything while they were charging up spells. So incredibly effective there, but again, we've got the large map now, we'll see if that changes things. Um, Oracle this time going to start with a haste, and then the ninja... Gonna charge forward, gonna throw up a Pyrus Plate. That's gonna miss Yoizo's ninja. And now haste going off on the Oracle and the Knight. Ninja now gonna get a chance to attack. 
Um, two big hits, one of which is going to get damage split back, so Ninja takes about 200 damage there. Uh, Wind Strike is going to hit Yoizo's Ninja and drop him into critical. We'll see if any units can get there in time. We have uh, another Please Eat going off on the Sacred. This time it's going to catch him, so we know he's got haste. He'll be in range for a uh, Mimic Titan, which will hit both ninjas, um, but uh, Pokétax's Ninja will get a chance to X Potion and Retreat, whereas Yoizo's is down now. Um, Black Mage is going to charge up, I believe, a Flare, and she's going to catch a... Um, a positive status from the Oracle. Flare's going to go off. Kakatoris takes it. Still alive after 225 damage. Now the Wizard's hasted as well. Knight hasted moves forward. Can't do anything. Uh, re on the Ninja. Again, going to shock her himself, but again, heal an enemy in the process and then retreat. Um, Pokedex's Ninja, not going to do anything. Not going to make a throw. We have another Mimic Titan going off. That's going to catch the Knight and the Ninja. Although I think he took it and triggered speed save. Pokedex, again, going to miss with the, uh, the Please Eat on the Ninja. We have the Cockatoris going for a big wind strike, which is going to get guarded. So lucky for Yoizo there. Okay, the ninja was down. The wizard's going to revive him with either raise one or two. Oracle charging up a spell. Knight retreating and going to get Hamido again. That's being a very devastating uh, combo for Pokétax so far. Um, ninja brought back up. He's going to get hit. Two hits and takes one counter. We have a paralyzed spell getting charged up, and that's going to trigger. So um, good luck for Yoizo there. And then uh, ninja's going to drop. So Pokétax now without two units. Uh, one don't acted, one down. Uh, Rebo not going to be able to do anything. The Cockatoris is going to catch the wizard mid-charge with a wind strike. F almost 400 damage, and she's down. And looks like the knight will take his turn to phoenix down her back to health. Uh, but Oracle's going to get a chance, and that's going to go for an offensive spell. Uh, Rebo again going for please eat, and that is going to miss. Um, and then Yubu is going to get uh, one hit, 90 damage, so it takes it pretty well, the evasion. Uh, Stop is going to get charged up on the Cockatoris, and that's going to hit... Uh, so things are going from bad to worse for Pokétax. Now one unit down, one stopped, and then Cure 3 going off. Knight and Wizard both catch it, so they're doing well. Paralyzed finally was off with the, um, for the Sacred, and the Rebo only able to do crap damage to that Ninja. Ninja responds with a big critical, and that unit's down. So um, they one stop, Pokétax has one stopped unit and one recently unparalyzed unit, but it's way out of position. Uh, I'm going to go for a Mimic Titan on that Ninja. That'll hit him and kill him. So we have uh, three units down. Uh, across both groups. We have uh, Don't Act, which charges up on the Cockatoris, so even when he's unstopped, well, he's dead now. Flare got him. Uh, Pokétax is Ninja um, uh, Boxalizes now, so it's just down to the uh, Sacred, who can't bring anyone else back. Um, so we'll see what he can pull off. He's going to go for a Berserk on the Knight, which is actually going to miss, and might be okay, might actually be better than that. Knight's going to uh, be conservative and bring the Ninja back. And then we have, uh, looks like Big Healing getting charged up. And she's going to, oh yeah, fire three, which is going to um, heal both units. Um, so that healing uh, coming back to uh, be really working, workable for Yoizo. Uh, Sigurd catches damage, managed to get in a kill, but he's going to get hit with the twilight of the ninja. Meatbow and Slash goes off, and he utterly destroys that ninja, um, who instantly is going to get brought back with uh, with Phoenix down, but that looked rough. And then, oh, and another Meatbow and Slash onto the wizard. Oh, that wizard must have been out of MP, because he went for a physical attack and got utterly boned by it. Ninja's going to get hit with a shake off, and he's down. So thank God for this for Yoizo that his knight has item because otherwise that sacred just raping through this team. He's gonna get a turn now. He's gonna go for the knight. 247 damage. Knight hits it. Gets a point of speed. Um, is not gonna go for items. Gonna go for a hit. And uh, sacred's down. So excellent effort by that sacred. But Yoizo takes the second round. We're gonna all go to the small map for round three. All right. It all comes down to this round three of Pokétax versus Yoizo. We are in the office in Lasalia Castle for um, the rubber match, and this could be very quick and very dirty, especially if those ninjas get haste early. Uh, Yoribo's gonna go, gonna try just that, 53%, and it's gonna miss. Uh, so bad luck there for Pokétax starting out. Yoizo's ninja gonna throw up a Pyrus Blade. That's gonna hit for damage. Uh, Kakatoris gonna start out, can't get in range. Sacred also not in range, but everybody moving forward. Um, we have the uh, wizard for Yoizo not doing anything. Oracle lining up. She's gonna get a spell off. Or she's going to attempt to spell. Uh, the ninja's going to spend the turn uh, healing the Erebo, which will allow that Paralyze to go off. Uh, Kakatoris catches it. That's a don't act. And a second don't act. For, so two creatures, uh, two monsters um, for Pogatax injured and or don't act. And then a missed status, and that's not what he needed at all. Ninja's going to get his back taken. 253 damage. He'll take 55 of it back. Um, Sacred can't do anything. Ninja's gonna go for Papyrus Plate. Oracle gets hit and is gonna counter flood him. No status is there and only minor damage. Um, Knight's still out of range. Wizard going to uh, charge up a Fire 3, which is gonna get insta cast on the ninja. He takes it and he is down. And just like that, Pokétax has just the one unit left that can even act. 
Um, haste now on both units. Yoizo catches it. The Rebo desperately trying to get something going, but will only be able to do a straight dash. He will avoid both the counters, uh, but isn't able to help his team out. He's going to catch um, both of those uh, two daggers in the face, so he's into critical now. Um, Knight going to throw an X potion onto the Oracle and the Wizard getting in place now. Neither of them going to be able to charge up anything. The Donax wear off. We'll see if Pokedex can possibly make a comeback. Um, but Wizard charging up a spell. We have uh, Charm's going to go off for the Ninja, and, and the counters are going to miss. So suddenly, Pogatax might have a chance if this Ninja can cancel out this attack. He's going to take the Wizard's side. Boom! One shot. She's down. Um, Oracle going to go for physical attack, though, and that's going to break Charm. So it's, uh, it's a three-on-three three now. We have Zephyr. Um, ooh, uh, Oracle going to get pushed back, but she's going to trigger Sleep on the counter flood. So Lucky Break for Yoizo there, and now the Wizard's back. Um, Sacred, not in range to do anything, which is really rough. Yuribo also running into the corner, and, uh, Pokétax's ninja about to crystallize. Yuribo's down yet again, um, Kagator's still asleep. Yeah, uh, ninja's gone now, and then we have, uh, healing up on three units on, uh, Yoizo, who looks like he's gonna take this third match. Spell getting charged up, but the Oracle's gonna get hit mid-charge, and she's probably gonna go down. Yeah, 364, she's gone, but Knight immediately in, in a position to bring her back, uh, just like that. Ninja, going to grab the crystal for full healing. And, uh, Kagator is gonna get hit, gonna wake, um, but gonna be really hurt, and gonna get an insta-cast flare, so, uh, he's down as well, just up to the Sacred now, who will go for a Mimic Titan, hit all four units, miss one, three take damage, one gets killed, but it's not gonna be enough, because, uh, the one dead can just come right back, and then the Ninja's gonna get, actually, Ninja's gonna use Chakra, but it's a four-on-one now, and the Sacred can't do anything to bring back his comrades, so, healing getting charged up, Knight gonna go on the offensive, oh, gonna hit and trigger, don't move, with, uh, 187 damage, uh, the first Ancient Sword I've seen in this uh, map in a while. Ninja's gonna get hit twice. Uh, Sacred still tanking it. Gonna go for another Mimic Titan, which is going to hit three units, but no kills there. And then Counter Flood, gonna uh, bring him into critical. So the only hope he has is of uh, avoiding attacks, and, but that's not gonna work. So congratulations to Yoizo. You have won and you are moving on. Pokétax, it's been fun. Thanks so much for playing.